Our reader today was Mrs Lorna Tunstall. We can now accurately call Lorna an ordinand of the church as she passed the final stages of her training in recent weeks and is permitted now to seek her own parish. We all hope that she will find one that is nice to visit for old friends and we also hope we can find a bus big enough for the inevitable crowd that will doubtless travel to her ordination and induction service wherever God may call her to serve. Let me mention a choice of listening next week, as well as the service on this YouTube channel and the audio version on the phone facility that's being quite widely used now. You will also find an act of worship recorded uh, here in Longforgan Manse on the programme New Every Sunday, which is on Radio Scotland at 7.30 in the morning. The background to our prayers of intercession is Set Me as a Seal Upon Your Heart by Renee Clausen, sung by the Iowa State University Singers, conducted by James Rod. Let us pray. Lord, you have encouraged us to bring everything to you in prayer, and we can scarcely grasp the privilege we have that lets us bring whatever troubles us and entrust it to you. We think of the huge needs of the world and the huge efforts that try to match them, the heroic efforts of medical staff and researchers and carers during this pandemic the heroic efforts of human rights campaigners in places where voices are silenced and freedoms crushed, the reach of human compassion into the places of greatest need and suffering. Lord, may your mercy reach where the world's mercy falls short. We pray for those we love most dearly in this world and for their troubles that vex us, for those who are ill or dying, for those who must step bravely into a new part of their lives through the gateway of marriage, childbirth, divorce, a new job, a recent disability or a bereavement. We pray for those we fear are losing their poise and for those we fear are doing harm to the lives of others and for those we most need to love us for our own peace of mind. Lord, may your mercy reach where the world's mercy falls short. And all our prayers we make in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, in whose own words we join our voices and pray, Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done in earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory for ever. Amen.